expected to award a $50 billion contract in the coming months to either Boeing or a European company to replace one of its aging fleets. And the fingers are really crossed on the Treasure Coast. As News Channel 5's Kristen Cadell explains, if Boeing gets it, it could mean more jobs for Stewart-based bought aircraft. It's this one part of an airplane that could propel Martin County to new heights. I think it's a matter of life and death. Stewart-based bought aircraft has been building the center wing section of the Boeing 767 since 1979. The center wing section alone weighs more than 7,000 pounds and takes more than 4,000 man hours to build. So in a turbulent economy, it has still meant a steady paycheck for employees like Charles Payne. We need this contract. America needs this airplane. A $50 billion winner-take-all contract is now up for grabs. The Air Force will choose between Boeing and a European-based company to replace its aging fleet of refueling tankers. The tanker will be used for... Uh, refueling other uh, airplanes uh, in the sky. If Boeing gets the contract, that means more jobs across the U.S. and dozens more right here in Stewart. It's all about jobs. U.S. Representative Tom Rooney says it's a win-win. How can you go wrong with an aircraft that is uh, more cost efficient, it's cheaper for maintenance, it's cheaper for fuel economy, and it's American made. Uh -huh. This simulator shows all the technological advances. The time it will take to refuel the uh, fighters is a lot less so they can go back, engage back in the battlefield. The details like how many planes and when they would all be built are still up in the air. The Air Force is set to make a decision by the year's end. In Martin County, I'm Kristen Cadell, WPTV News Channel 5.